NFL Training Camp 2024, Panthers RB Rashid Penny retires. NFL training camps are officially open for every franchise across the league. Here are the answers to some key questions and the latest updates from around summer practices. Find out with Frank Schwab season preview power rankings countdown right here. The Chicago Bears and Houston Texans will meet in the 2024 Hall of Fame game on Thursday, August 1st at 8 p.m. ET in Canton, Ohio. The game will be broadcast on ESPN and ABC. The preseason ends on Sunday, August 25th and NFL roster cutdown day is Tuesday, August 27th. The performances of the first-round rookie quarterbacks including Chicago's Caleb Williams, Washington's Jaden Daniels, New England's Drake May, Minnesota's JJ. McCarthy, Atlanta's Michael Penix Jr. and Denver's Bo Nix will be watched closely. In terms of contract situations to monitor Packers QB Jordan Love struck a record deal with the Packers and Dolphins quarterback Tua Tagovailo got a hefty new contract a few days into camp but Cowboys wide receiver C.D. Lamb and 49ers receiver Brandon A.I. could be in line for new deals these next few weeks or lingering drama if they don't get them. As always there are buzzy QB competitions in store as well highlighted by Russell Wilson vs. Justin Fields in Pittsburgh. Another to keep an eye on is Gardner Minshew vs. Aiden O'Connell in Las Vegas. Meanwhile Maynix McCarthy and Penix will all try to push presumed starters as much as possible in their camps and here's a wild card, Daniel Jones vs. Drew Locke with the Giants. The Bears starters, including Caleb Williams, won't play in the Hall of Fame game coach Matt Eberflus told reporters. Tyson Bagent who has been grinding his absolute face off will start at QB. One of the Cowboys best defenders is back from a torn ACL. Just in, Cowboy CB Trevin Diggs has passed his physical and has been removed from the pup list. He can practice as soon as today's first padded practice in Oxnard.7 is back. Robert Sally says that Aaron Rodgers will not play in the first two preseason games but Rodgers and the Jets have not discussed if he would play at all in the third preseason game against the Giants. Justin Fields is taking first team reps in 11-on-11 red zone work. He hit George Pickens on a one-handed catch hugging the right sideline during this period where filming is prohibited. Rookie WR Roman Wilson appeared to be injured on a jet sweep during seven shots. He left practice on a cart. The Steelers drafted Wilson a key player for Michigan in its national title run in the third round of the draft, number 84 overall. Panthers placed veteran RB Rashid Penny on the reserve slash retired list Tuesday. The 28-year-old Penny played five years for the Seahawks and spent last season with the Eagles. Source. The NFL sent a memo to all 32 teams last Thursday as a warning slash reminder that as kickers tinker with new kicking techniques they cannot place the ball flat on the kicking tee as the Patriots and most teams practiced this spring. The memo. Ravens QB Lamar Jackson was asked about John Harbaugh saying the goal is to make him the greatest QB of all time Lamar, I'm not the GOAT Tom Brady is the GOAT. But, I believe that is motivation. I appreciate that from coach. I'm still on my way. Quarterback contracts are going to be discussed every year as players sign new deals and resolve contract disputes with their teams. This summer saw a slew of quarterbacks sign market rate extensions but where this year differed from previous years to a degree is that a few of these quarterbacks that sign deals largely have incomplete resumes. Still the contracts of Jordan Love Tua Tagovailoa and Trevor Lawrence have some people scratching their heads. Joe Burrow participating in about half of today's practice as Bengals continue to manage workload in return from torn ligament in wrist of throwing hand. Zach Taylor says no setbacks or complaints from Burrow. This was a schedule decided weeks ago to save Burrow from himself. Hello from training camp stop for the Cincinnati Bengals. WRJ Amar Chase is here in his number one jersey and a baseball cap helping with drills but not practicing on final day before pads. Pro Bowler continues to seek contract extension. Zach Taylor says J. Amar Chase has been engaged aware and positive. If anybody has a healthy relationship with the quarterback and they're always talking it's Joe, Burrow, and J. Amar and T. Higgins, Taylor said. 
Still he adds there are always new routes and concepts that could use work. As the Bengals await wide receiver Jamar Chase's return to practice head coach Zach Taylor says his brother is killing me for my plan he wants to know my plan. No clear answer from Taylor on whether Jamar will practice tomorrow on pads day one. Just that they have a plan. Holding continues for now. Then Juden one of New England's best players walked off the field. Gerard Mayo appears to exchange some words with Matthew Juden who is not participating in practice today. Juden seen exiting the field after their conversation.